Hey guys, so today I got a parcel that I ordered a while back, oh, not while back, two days ago. Uh, this is kind of a new series on the channel, it's like an unboxing series. So, because I'm not sure how much time I've got left on the uh, recording device, I'm going to try and open this as fast as possible. So I'm just cutting it all open here. And here we go. So this is my new baby. Oh, and I've got some spare stuff with it, so I've got a laser kit, a magazine, look at <laughs> that, how nice is that, let's open it up, so I mean, this is partially for my own, like, uh, you know, just because I wanted it, and because I want to use it for dead infestation as one of the prop weapons. So obviously it's not completely black at the minute, but it will be because I'm going to spray paint a, meta a metallic black paint cover over the top of it. So it looks a little bit more realistic, and I have another, whoops, and I will paint it silverish as well, so it uh, also it looks a bit Worn and tall, bit wear and tear. Let's just open that all up. So I've got to piece it together. So it's got an extendable stock. There we go. <laughs> oh, this is a little bit exciting. <laughs> it's getting me a little bit excited. This is bloody lovely. So it also has a little silencer to go on top of it. So we'll just put that on. All of this actually with it was free. So the silencer was free. I can't put the silencer on at the minute because I'm concentrating on talking. Um, I also got a scope with it, I believe. Yeah, that's there. Uh, and then I've got a little handle to go up the front here. Okay, there we go. So now, I've got a little grip on there as well. This is actually uh, part, it's like a plasticky metal. It's quite heavy, it's really good. It's really cool though. Um, I have a torch to go on the other side of it. So this, does this work yet? Or do I have to put batteries in it? Okay, so the camera cut out. So the sound might be a little bit different now, and the quality will be a little bit different. But this gun is the M83, it's all here, M83, I'll put it in the title as well. Uh, new generation airsoft electronic gun, uh, and then I've actually got a strap for it as well. So I can actually strap it around myself so I don't have to hold it all the time, so it just be like sitting here like that. So part of the strap will go here, and the other part of the strap goes here, as you can see there. And this is actually just how I close the stock so it's a little bit smaller take off the safety, uh, take off the uh, silencer now, I can tell you for a fact I'm going to be doing a hell of a lot of videos with this I believe because just look at it how cool is it it's bloody cool that's what it is it's bloody cool uh, I'm going to try to sort this out now and it's too dark to do anything with it at the minute, so you'll next see me outside, which will actually be tomorrow, which is still like 10 seconds for you guys in the video. So I'll see you when it's charged up, ready to fire, and ready to go. See you in a minute. Okay guys, you probably hear all the traffic about and whatnot, but uh, it's a couple of days later. I've charged it up, I don't know how much I've charged it, because it doesn't really tell me how much I've charged it. So... As I said before, this is a one-to-one -one scale model of an M4, and I'm now going to test it out. I'm going to shoot a bottle. Uh, where should I put the bottle? It's about here on the end. So I've equipped it with a couple of the upgrades. There was a scope as well, as I pointed out, which you have to take this off and then put the scope there, but I prefer to have a little handle to hold on to. There also was a uh, strap to go around me, but didn't really want to use that. So at the minute I have currently got the laser sight which I won't point it at you, but
but uh, if I just hold my grip here, don't know if you can see, but it actually lights up. Probably can't see it on the video. And then obviously I've got the torch, which is here. Turn that off. Can we turn it off? Yeah, good. So I'm just going to quickly load the gun. And the way you do that is, so I've got 20 pellets in here. So I put 20 pellets in here. It does, I tried it out a couple of days ago and it shot about 45. That's how much I could load. So I'm now going to load all these. About 20 of them. There we go. That's it. That's loaded. So it's got it's got three settings. It's got safe mode, semi, and auto. So the semi is a single shot burst. And it's actually got another safety here. So you have to hold down this before you fire. And then you fire and it fires. Like that. But uh, I'm using the cheap pellets that come with it at the minute, just because. Let's reset that. So I'm using the cheap pellets at the minute because the other ones, as I say, are a little bit—they're a little bit expensive, and it shoots them out quite fast. So I don't want to waste them. This is pretty close, cl too much close than I need to be. So the wind can literally just take these pellets, and I'll probably miss, even though I'm standing here. I oh, know I got it. There we go. Yeah, sorry about the window there. <laughs> and then we can try it on this mode, which is auto. This will be fun. You can see how fast it shoots. <laughs> so that's pretty dang cool, right? So this is one of the two barrels. There's like a silenced barrel. Obviously, it doesn't actually silence the gun, though. And then there's this barrel that goes on the end. So let me see. I don't know how many I just fired then. Okay, there is still some in here. I just dropped them. Just dropped two. Let's fire off the remaining ones. Because why the hell not? Right. I love this gun so much. There we go, that was all that was left. <laughs> so, that's it, that's the gun, and it is absolutely amazing. Well worth what I paid for it. And you can find a link in the description below to this gun and the website I got it from. Hope you guys enjoyed that little unboxing slash review I've done of the gun there. And until my next unboxing next month, which I have no idea what the hell it's going to be, but obviously I'm going to have a lot of Christmas presents, aren't I? So hopefully there's something good there to unbox. You're shaking your head. Nothing good to unbox? Well, it looks like I'll be buying myself something else to unbox. Until next time. Goodbye!